Heather Casper from the Minnesota Marine Art Museum, coming to you today from my kitchen. I wanted to share with you a beautiful painting and a couple of poems. This painting by George Lukes is called The Swan Boats, and it shows a very special place in Boston, Massachusetts. This place is the Boston Public Gardens, and it contains several ponds. On one of these ponds, people can see real swans. They can even take a ride on a swan boat. Swan boats move when the driver pedals really fast with their feet, just like a bicycle, to make the boat go. Something we don't see in this painting, which we usually do see at a pond, are ducks. Ducks can dive and swim underneath the water to catch fish for their food. Some ducks dabble, which means they flip over upside down underwater to nibble on plants, insects, and tiny worms. My friend Julie is going to read to you two poems about dabbling ducks while you look at this pretty artwork by George Lukes. Ducks Diddy by Kenneth Graham. All along the backwater, through the rushes tall, ducks are a dabbling up tails all. Ducks tails, drakes tails, yellow feet a quiver, yellow bills all out of sight, busy in the river. Slushy green undergrowth where the roach swim, here we keep our larder cool and full and dim. Everyone for what he likes, we like to be, heads down, tails up, dabbling free. High in the blue above, swift swirl and call, we are down a dabbling, up tails all. The Duck by Ogden Nash Behold the duck, it does not cluck. A cluck it lacks, it quacks. It is specially fond of a puddle or pond. When it dines or sups, it bottoms ups. I love that last poem. Thanks, Julie. We hope to see you and your grown-up really soon at the museum. Until then, take care of each other. Bye.